I feel like I'm not on point today for some reason. Oh, well. This is it why happens. there's an edit feature. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> don't, I don't worry. This isn't a live stream. Maybe it's because I started doing live streams, so now it's I'm more conscious of it. This is not a live stream. Yeah. You could say flubs all day long if you want. <laughs> okay. Flub, 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 flub. Flub, flub. Flub. All right. Ready? Shuffle that song. We got to <laughs> We got to... we're shortening. That's not right. <laughs> we're shortening the intro, but... <laughs> Not, quite not like much. eliminating it totally. I'm just anxious. Okay, you ready? Like excited anxious. Excited. Not like anxiety anxious. Okay. Excited anxious. Cool. <laughs> That's a good distinction. Should clarify. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Okay. We're, we're excited. All right, let's get into it. This is gonna be a good, good time. You think so? I hope so. Right. Right. Hope we shuffle into something good. <laughs> just kidding. All right. I don't know why I'm moving my shoulders. <laughs> All right. Hello, everybody, and welcome to Nathan on Shuffle and our latest episode of Jana Reacts. I'm, of course, Nathan, and I have Jana here. Hello. And this is where we shuffle into random prog songs that my wife most likely hasn't heard before. So <laughs> yep. let's shuffle into the song, right? Shuffle that song. Let's All right. do it. All right, cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's shuffle, see what shuffle. we got. Oh, a big boy. This is a big one. <laughs> a big boy. <laughs> Sorry. I don't know that's a weird way to put it. This is a big major prog epic. Yeah. This is Supper's, Supper's ready. ready. Yeah. Have I heard? Are this you before? okay with doing an epic? An Just epic? Kidding. Oh, uh, yeah. Of course, it's fine. <laughs> Twenty-three minutes. If we're doing prog music, we're gonna come across minutes. them. Twenty-three minutes. Yeah, this is a major. You know, of course, this is from Genesis, from their album Foxtrot. Okay. This is kind of their biggest known. Is that the album? Epic prog I like that piece. Fox. That's cool. Yeah. This is their biggest prog piece? Yeah. This is kind of what they're known for. <gasps> known as one of the biggest, best prog epics of all time, I would say. Up there with, like, cl close to the edge. What if I hate it? Then everyone's going to be I mad at you. Uh, <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> I haven't heard close to the edge, right? No, we still haven't shuffled into that one yet either, so. But I did hear 2112. That's, like, a big one, Yeah, right? that's a big epic, And too. I love that. That was good. So maybe I'll love this. Yeah. If you like that kind of style. Kind of storytelling and... I'm a little nervous now. now and it's, it's long, but it's, now it's anxious, broken anxious. up into sections. So it's kind of like several smaller <gasps> pieces strung together to make a full okay. epic. Okay. So yeah. it's like all broken up. Yeah. I like that. Yeah. So that might be to your taste. Okay. So... So it's like listening to five songs. <laughs> yeah. You could view it that way. Like if that helps you. five songs. Because <laughs> they're not meant to be... <laughs> Taken out of context. All right, fine. So. I guess they, they didn't have the shuffle feature back then, so they didn't have to worry about that. But now people would shuffle it. And yeah, it would break break it up. Yeah. And that's not what they wanted. All right. Are we good? I'm ready. Oh. All right. What is it called again? Um, It is called Supper's Ready. Supper's Ready by Foxtrot. By, by Genesis. Genesis. And the album is Foxtrot. Foxtrot. We've done a couple of Genesis songs. Yeah, we've done a couple. Okay. So, ready to get into it? I am so ready. All right. I am a little nervous. <laughs> okay, let's play the song. Walking across the city. Starts right away. Yeah, we're right in. Vision of sitting beside you, I look into your eyes as the sound of motor cars. Fades in the night time I swear I saw your face change It didn't seem quite right And it's Hello babe With your guardian ass so blue Hey my baby Don't you know our love is true With our eyes, a distance falls around our bodies. Out in the garden, the moon seems very bright. Six saintly shrouded men move across the lawn slowly. The seventh walks in front. 
with a cross held high in hand And it's Hey babe Your supper's waiting for you Hey my baby Don't you know our love is true I've been so far from here Far from your warm arms It's good to feel you again It's been a long, long time
saw a host of dark skinned warriors standing still below the ground. Wandering in the chaos the battle has left We climb up the mountain of human flesh To a plateau of green grass and green trees Full of light A young figure Sit still by a pool He's been stamped Human bacon By some butchery tool He is you Social security Took care of this lad we watch in reverence as Narcissus is turned to a flower. A flower? If you go down to Willow Farm to look for butterflies, butterflies, butterflies. Open your eyes, it's full of surprise. Everyone rides like a fox on the rocks. The musical box Oh, there's mum and dad And good and bad And everyone's happy to be here There's Winston Churchill dressed in drag He used to be a British flag
everyone We're changing everyone We'll name them all, we've had them here And the real stars are still to appear Feel your body melt
a journey <laughs> oh yeah yeah um i felt like i really went on a journey with that one yeah yeah but and the ending was so satisfying yeah yeah like the whole the whole section at the end like the last couple minutes of it because it had all the it, well we'll get to all that but it had all that <laughs> stuff before it but then the last few it was like I don't know, it just sounded positive and pleasing to my ear, and it was like a good, like, satisfying ending after this intense <laughs> battle and, and, right. and um, it, like, insistent drumbeat through a lot of it. Right. And that's a good thing. I love the, I love the insistent drumbeat. <laughs> I like any song with that. Yeah, it's just an epic conclusion, certainly, and they kind of mm-hmm. repeat back, kind of... Yeah, repeated the, a lot of The beginning part, and yeah. yeah. And so, just in a big, epic kind of fashion, which is what great, epic prog songs do, is they just, like, bring home this, like, classic mm-hmm. ending that's just really magnificent and, and yeah. brings you to this epic conclusion. It's emotional, and it's, like, really yeah. gorgeous and, and big and, and grand in its scope. I really like that. Yeah, yeah. I feel like it started out with... Um, it started, like, right away. Like, a lot yeah. of, like, these, yeah, it starts right these into long it. songs, they'll do, like, this long, like, two like or intro three minute or intro overture or, or something, yeah. <laughs> yeah, but they, like, started right away, yeah, and exactly. that was cool. Um, there is, as a point, the song before this, I believe, is, like, kind of a short acoustic... Um, instrumental uh, which kind of leads into this so i think that kind of plays so it does as have that, a long intro <laughs> as that intro a little bit and then goes into this yeah. okay so um yeah i felt like it it well in what we listened to like started right off and and was really great and it had um 
I, I immediately liked all the language because it said like, hey, babe. And like, that's what <laughs> I say to you all the time, like right. to get your attention. It's like, hey, babe, babe, <laughs> hey, babe, <laughs> hey, babe. <laughs> it's like that, you know, and so, yeah. um, so that just like kind of made me, you know, yeah. smirk a little you bit. You like that a little. <laughs> Laugh about that in, internally. <laughs> um, that is cool. Yeah. And then it had like a good, um, after a couple minutes, it had like this fun, this fun, fun interlude mm-hmm. I don't know. it was just like it <laughs> yeah. had like a lot of I mean, like there's a lot of those like kind of musical fun kind of interlude moments yeah. and like a lot of you know guitar and keyboard playing off of yeah. each other and 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 yeah it's really good yeah and then after that it, it came it started it was talking about in the lyrics about a battle mm-hmm. and um and and the music i felt like it sounded like kind a of battle like that. Yeah, yeah and it was really good so a lot of like um noise is not the right like i don't mean that in a negative way right, there was a yeah. lot going on right and so there was a lot of noise going on at that time at musical noise and <laughs> a lot going on and so it felt like like this battle was raging yeah. and then after that it like was a little bit celebratory uh-huh. like positive sounding again but then after the positive sounding it was like more like reserved or yes yeah. more reserved and in it and it was like the the music was like it was matching the lyrics because the lyrics were talking about like the consequences of battle like well mm-hmm. let's climb up and see like see the trees and things at this on the top of this hill and all these beautiful things but we're climbing up all these dead bodies to get there so it's like yeah, consequences yeah. of war consequences of battle so it's right. it's um um i thought that the music lended itself really well to like what it was talking about and i'm not sure like i'm i'm never sure about lyrics if yeah, i'm like i'm not interpreting either, yeah. them correctly or not but i think it's it's kind of interesting because it makes me think also of gates of delirium by yes which we haven't shuffled into but i hope someday in the future which also kind of personifies a battle with music okay. i think it's it's a cool effect that they can do with prog because there's so much different instrumentation and they can be a little bit more you know, like have a lot of different instruments and have heavier sections and yeah. and a lot of percussion and stuff that can kind of simulate a battle and this, whatnot. This is an older one, right? Yeah, this from is an older... From 70s? Yeah, from 70... I want to say 72, but let me make sure. Yeah, 72. Okay, 72. Okay. Yeah. Um. Which the Yes piece came out a couple of years later that I'm talking about. But, oh, okay. But yeah, I think that's a cool effect that... Prog music, that's why I like prog as a style, because there's a lot you can do with it. It can really paint a picture that you're trying to tell. There's a lot of different variation that you can insert and tell a story with. Whereas a standard, you know, three-minute pop song, it's hard to really convey some of these more complex storytelling type of ideas, I think. So it's just, it's a unique type of of music that it's able to, to utilize. Yeah. Rather than just telling it through the words, they're actually painting a story with, with the, music. the music itself. Because after that, it got, like, kind of wacky. <laughs> yeah, there's the, like, the Willow Farm section that's, like, kind of iconic. That it's this kind of wacky, bouncy, like, <laughs> section in the middle of this big epic piece, yeah. But that's prog, you know? <laughs> they have, like, really creative, clever kind of things that pop in and add variety and make it interesting and fun. And that's what I love about it. So I know it's for a first listen, it's a little like, well, what are they doing now? No, I like it. <laughs> but then after all of that, like there was all those sections, like, mm-hmm. you know, the, the wacky part, the battle part, the reverent part, you know, yeah. all of that. Mm-hmm. Then it started that, that rock beat, like that drum beat, uh-huh. which was the insistent drum beat that I was talking about yeah, and yeah. how it just like, dun, 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 dun. Right, and it's like kind of unique, I think, in its time signature. And, yeah, and, okay. You know, so, it's, so it's <laughs> that might be why it's a little I, bit <laughs> off kilter, perhaps. You know. Yeah, because I'm like, I appreciate a good beat. Yeah. And and I like to be able to like tap my toes or or nod my head to it, and then um, all of a sudden I realize I'm not matching up with it, and I'm and I and I think, man, I have no rhythm. Like I cannot like hold the beat for anything. But then it's. It's because, like, they've got a, an odd time signature. Yeah. And I want to so, say it's, like, 9-8 or, like, I nine, think that's... 9-8? What? I'd have to... Why? 
Why? Look up that section, but I think it's like Apocalypse in 9 8 is what I remember. <sighs> but yeah. So that section is called Apocalypse in 9 8. So that's because of the time signature of that <laughs> instrumental piece that's. 9 8. Yeah. <laughs> so uh, that's something prog music taking does. Take me back to high school <laughs> when I was in marching band in high school and we had. Some of our songs were written in 7-8. Seven, so, no, that's not right. Like 5-4. Okay. Okay. That's what it was. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, so 5-4. It was it was awful trying to march <laughs> to it. And so, like, I, every time I, like, have these weird time signatures and they come up and I'm just like, oh, no, not again. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's like, yeah. you know, a Us million years ago, but Prog nerds still. just love that stuff because it's, you know, <laughs> makes it different and quirky and... and See, I'm, list and I'm listening to it. I'm, and I'm following along, and like all of a sudden, I feel like something like, like it's like somebody pushed me, and I'm like <laughs> off, off, out off of, the I'm out of something. step. Yeah, and and so it's it's um it, it's a little like it's this one this one it's it's usually jarring for me, and this one it was it was so subtle that that I didn't know that I was like off the beat until I was back on it. And so like, I don't like, yeah. it took me, it took me a couple minutes of this insistent drum beat to realize that it was, this must be a weird time signature <laughs> because I can't keep this beat. Yeah. But <laughs> so, I think that's purposeful, right? To yeah. kind of personify the, the story they're telling. Yeah. It's a little bit off and you know, it's <laughs> like, a, like it said, apocalypse. So it's yeah. talking about a very strange situation. And yeah. so the beats a little bit off. And I think that's part of it. I'm messing with my mind. <laughs> <laughs> They're messing with you. <laughs> I think that I'm fine and like on the beat and like in step. And then all of a sudden I'm not. Yeah. <laughs> not again. But yeah, it's a great <sighs> iconic section for sure. Yeah. In prog music. It was great. It was and great. then it leads to and then that, that satisfying epic conclusion. Ending. Yeah, that was we so talked good. About. Yeah, I think it's just kind of the perfect epic. This is one of the best examples of like a progressive rock epic if you were to show yeah. someone like what's what's a progressive rock epic what does that mean i think this is a good example i of see one. why people like it yay i get it <laughs> i mean for for the time that it came out i think that it was it was probably really like uh revolutionary yeah I very i don't know yeah it was yeah i'm sure hmm. so awesome cool <laughs> i liked it you liked I approve. it you approve of it yeah yeah that's good, yeah. I always get nervous. Like we always talk about how long songs you could lose attention, or yeah. But I feel like there's I mean, so much going on with this. It's there, there were a few moments, few moments in there of it that yeah. I was just like, "What was I making for dinner again tonight?" <laughs> Wait, I'm back in the song. <laughs> but you, you know, can like, understand, just like, like the purpose behind it, at least, yeah. like that it's because I think some people they hear a 20 minute song, they're like, "Oh, why?" Are, What's the point? Why can't yeah. you cut that down? This, but this, they have a lot of story mm -hmm. to tell and a lot of different sections they're trying yeah. to. I think me losing bring about. my my focus is totally my own deal and my yeah. own my own problem. But it's um, this one. I thought if you're gonna have a long song, this was the way to do it because okay. it had all these different sections yeah. and um, it it progressed. It told the story. It it told the musical journey, and yeah. I. Really enjoyed it. Not so. unlike the Rush 2112. You, yeah, it was like that. Mentioned. Yeah. Yeah, so. Good cool. times. All right. I approve. Thank you guys so much for joining us. Hopefully you appreciated this uh, discussion. I don't, I about <laughs> I don't wait until the very end. I'm so sorry. <laughs> so hopefully you guys enjoyed this, uh, our discussion and, and reaction. Um, if you like these videos, we do this weekly and we have a lot of fun with it. So we love it if you joined us and, and subscribe. subscribe to our channel. Yeah. So thank you guys so much. And hopefully you're out there enjoying the music, whatever you got going on in your playlists out there. Yep. So thank you guys. And we'll see you in a future video. Hopefully. Enjoy the music. Bye. Bye.